today we are going to modestly stuff my second funds binder let's go hi beautiful thank you for tuning into my channel my name is keisha aka keisha budgets and i'm a single mom with two little girls just trying to maneuver through this world and i like helping other single moms like me with budgeting and finance and i do this by way of cash envelope stuffings savings challenges and crushing that debt so if you find value in that type of video please hit subscribe okay y'all let's get this party started so but before we get it started i want to just give you all a quick overview of my second fun setup for 2022 these are the the items that i will um be stuffing um and if you haven't checked that video out it will be linked in the description please check it out if you really want a great tutorial of, well, at least I think it's great. And my viewers think it's great. <laughs> but if you want a great tutorial to help you to, to figure out how to save money on a, 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 a single parent income or on low income, please check it out. Okay. So, um, well, you know what? I'm going to sit this aside and I just talk through it as I go. Okay. Because I want to be mindful of your time. Because time, y'all, is of the essence. <laughs> it really is. Okay? So, I'm not going to take these out. I'm just going to sit this on the side here. Let me get my pen and my calculator. So, how y'all doing? I hope y'all doing good. So, I'm just getting back on the scene with my gangster lean. Um, <laughs> so, let's, let, let's, let's get things going. So, for car taxes, I slated to do $45 per month. I mean, per pay period because my taxes are due in July. So, um, because I only have 20s and 10s, um, we're just going to do uh, $40. And I'll, I'll, I'll get caught up later. Because, you know, sometimes that, that's that's how it's going to go down. It's, it's not necessarily going to go down how you want it to. Um, let me see. Should I... Write it out as I go. I'm just going to put the amount and I'll fill the rest in later. Um, so I won't forget that I, I'm just adding $40. Cause like I said, I don't want to monopolize your time. Time is of the essence. So I'm just going to put $40 in here. So let's see what we have. So we have $95. Yo, that 50 didn't throw me off. Woohoo. <laughs> $90. Okay. So, for house taxes, um, I have zero. And I'm going to do $20 for pay period. So, I'll just put that 20 down. And I'll fill the rest in later. So, that's $20. Because I just paid my house taxes in January. So, I got some time to save up. $430. Yay. Um, termite bond is $10. So I have nothing in that. I just paid that in December. Because a lot of my things come out like December, January, or maybe during the summertime. So, so yeah, a lot of these are empty. AC service. Y'all, I need to get my AC service. I definitely call them for spring because I think I missed the winter time. So, so far my unit is doing fine. So I have a hundred dollars in there and I'm going to add, okay, over here it says 15, 12 to 15, but because I don't, well really I need 12 and I was going to bump it up to 15. But since I don't have any fives, we're just going to do that happy 10 right there. Cause I already have a hundred dollars in here. So, Happy about that. So that'll be the 110 for that. And I'll fill all these out later off camera. Um, Christmas. Now we're gonna do a modest Christmas. Last Christmas I was trying to be out all oh, big and bad. Um trying to save 880, which I only end up saving about saving about four or five hundred. Um, but we're gonna have a modest Christmas. My girls had big ticketed items last Christmas. But we're going to have a modest Christmas this year. 
Um, some people may be getting some homemade items. Some people may be getting baked cookies. But I really need to pay off my credit card, this Discover card. And I really need to um, save more money. So we're going to have a modest Christmas this year. I don't want to be... Oh, well, it's not 20. It's going to be 10. I don't want to be like some people. Oh, I'm not doing Christmas this year. I'm like, what? Who does that? But I don't want to be like that. I'd rather give you something that I made uh, or, you know, something small or uh, give. I want to share because I'm a giver. I, I'm definitely a giver. I do want to give. But this year, it may not be a lot. I've already decided that it may not be a lot. And I'm okay with that. I really am. Okay, gifts. It's 10 because, you know, somebody is always getting married or having a baby or birthday party or something like that. So I'm going to do 10 here. For that, which I probably do need to bump that up, but oh well. It is what it is. So I used to, to want to give people more expensive gifts. Not really expensive, but expensive what I thought was expensive. But um, but I realized that I really can't afford that. I'm trying to get on out of debt. I, I, I can't. I can't afford that. So I'm not going to try to... To do that anymore. Okay, uh, lawn care is 25. I already have 55 in there. So I'm gonna put 20, 20 in here. It says I don't have any five, y'all. Sorry. So I'm gonna put 20 in here. So I have 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75 dollars. So I'm shooting for 300 by June because my lawn guy, he, he rakes my backyard where his son does. And now his son is going in the Air Force. So I don't know who's going to do all that. So we'll see. Because usually, he, usually he'll contact me around the springtime. But we shall see. Um, household, I'm trying to say 600 Um for the for the house because of uh, various things that I'm planning that I want to happen so I'm gonna put 20 in there which originally was 25 but like I said I, when I get some fives I just get caught up okay so I'm gonna put 20 in there Let's see. Okay, for medical, my goal is 200, but I need to break this 20 because I need to take some money out because I've been, let me see, my little slip I wrote some stuff on um, because y'all, I have a bad habit of, I'm saving, I have stuff in the medical for, you know, like uh, Loridine for my for my girls or the um, Citrazine for me, that's a Zyrtec, y'all, for Claritin and flu knees because we have sinus allergies and different little things i may need for them um like vitamins and stuff like that i was not taking it out of my medical and y'all that's medical <laughs> anything that i need from the pharmacy anything like that so i need to break this hundred and take out let me see 30 40 50 dollars so let me see do i have enough to break this hundred 20 40 50 60, 70, 80, 90. That's $90. Well, I'll just use this. You know, I can't take this out. So I still need to. Okay, let me let me just skip this one. And let's go to my dental. Because I need to stuff this one too. Because I need to get some dental work done. Um, end of this year. I have 30. So I'm. They told me I need to, even with my insurance, I need to bring a thousand dollars. Um, because at first I was like, I don't know if I really want to get that done, but I've noticed that that tooth has started to bother me again. So I probably need to get that taken care of. So that'll be forty dollars that I'm going to add to that. So that'll be seventy dollars. Like I said, I got to get back on track because I'm going to have to do another second fund stuffing. So I need to do at least two a month because I have I get paid twice a month. 
So I, I gotta get caught up. But I, I'm gonna get caught up. It's gonna happen, Captain. Okay. So how much did I say that was? 40, 60, 70, $70. Okay, so let's see. What are we going to do with this? Now, what I am going to do, I'm just going to leave this in here. And I'm going to, wow, look at that, look, $50. So, I'll just use this to put back into my account for the meds that I had to purchase for the three of us. So this won't get stuffed, um, which everything else got stuffed. So I'll use this, um, which I did have. Normally, I did allocate $210 for pay, per pay period. But I think I ended up, because I had some extra money for this being like maybe $240 or $50 or something like that. And if I could break some have some extra fives, then I could probably stuff some stuff. Let me see. You want to have some? Oh, look here. Oh, no, that's a 50. <laughs> so, I'm going to have to, um, because I did have enough to stuff like I wanted to, but I just didn't have any fives. So, I'm going to have to get some fives, and I just have to do whatever, which I got to. Uh, I'll probably double up on my next stuffing. To get caught up for the the other one I didn't do for January. So this one would, would be for January. Because like I said, I've had this money set aside for like two, three weeks. But it just didn't happen. I didn't feel good. My, my baby wasn't feeling good. And just getting back to work and getting back on track has been the struggle. So I'm going to use this 50 to put back into my checking account for our meds. So ain't got good. That worked out great. So that is our... Thinking fun stuff in for today, and I hope that you have found value in this video. Um, and if you have not started sinking funds, um, please, please consider doing it. Check out my video, a sinking fund setup for 2022. There are other content creators that do sinking funds as well. They will save your life because I used to be that that person that would just throw my money up in the air, spin around in it. Then when it was when it was time to pay. Um, a large bill like tech, a tax or to pay um, some type of insurance like my termite bond, I didn't have the money and I would have to take it out my check. And that would put my, my, my bill money behind. But this has helped me. I've been really using this for about two, going on my third year, and it's really been helpful. Um, so I hope you decide to set up your own second funds. And some people do it electronically. Um, some people don't like cash stuffing, but I like stuffing cash because I like counting my money. I don't know about you, but I like counting my money. But anyway, love you guys so much. And remember, take care of your money and your money take care of you. See you guys in the next one. Bye.